Dateline, October 10th, 1924, Daybreak. Two Sonans look to the skies in anticipation of the United States Navy airship Shenandoah passing overhead on its way to San Diego, California. The Shenandoah's transatlantic flight is part of a research project on the long-distance airship travel that the Navy hopes will revolutionize military and commercial airship service. A 1920 Naval Appropriations Bill set aside $1.5 million, or $18 million today, for the construction of an airship. The Navy saw dirigibles as the transportation of the future, and the Shenandoah, or ZR-1, as the prototype for fleets of military and commercial airships. Her design is based on a German Zeppelin. Construction began in February 1921. Operations and maintenance of the Shenandoah required a steep learning curve. As the first of its kind, crewmen had to practice on the ship itself, resulting in mishaps and repairs. It was also expensive to fly. Because of recent tragedies involving hydrogen explosions, pricey helium was used. Crewmen also had difficulty learning how to moor the airships to stationary and floating masts. Originally, the Shenandoah was to make an Arctic flight, but on October 7, 1924, the airship set out not for the frozen north, but for sunny San Diego, California. After a late departure from Fort Worth, the Shenandoah traveled through the rest of Texas, New Mexico, and into Arizona. At 5.20 a.m., the University of Arizona picked up a hurry call from the Shenandoah which had just passed Benson for help in getting their bearings. The airship was spotted in Tucson at 540 and flew over the city at 630. They were reported to be flying at 1500 feet. Over Gila Bend, letters were dropped out of the Shenandoah, taken to the Gila Bend post office and delivered the rest of the way by the post office department. We don't know how many letters there were, but one surviving postcard is in the collection of the Postal History Foundation. The Shenandoah did make it to San Diego, then up and down the West Coast, and back to Lakehurst again. On September 2, 1925, while conducting a Midwest flight exercise, the Shenandoah encountered atmospheric instability. It was tossed around violently, shooting up at 2100 feet per minute. Engines failed, struts snapped, and the airship began to break apart. It crashed on a farm near Sharon, Ohio. 14 of 43 crew members died. <laughs>